Good afternoon, I'm Joe Malone. I'm a, a physician with the Centers for Z Disease Control and Prevention. I'm with the PMI program, or Pre President's Malaria Initiative. Behind me are bales of uh, uh, in, uh, long-lasting insecticidal uh, bed nets. These are one of the key uh, weapons we have to uh, battle uh, uh, malaria and to control malaria here in Ethiopia. Across the way we also have another uh, 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 wall full of uh, medications. These are uh, Coartem. Uh, uh, this is a uh, medication, uh, artemisin-containing combination therapy, which is uh, one of the key medications uh, needed to uh, to uh, cure uh, malaria if you're infected with it. Um, in, in general, uh, the President's Malaria Program is one of the key uh, partners here in Ethiopia and around the world for uh, implementing proven um, interventions that, uh, uh, that control malaria and uh, move towards reducing the burden of malaria on the world. Ethiopia is, uh, is uh, one of the larger uh, 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 U.S. government funded malaria programs in the world. Uh, we've had a partnership for uh, uh, three or four years now with the Ethiopian government. Uh, we are we're in partnership with all, uh, with a one U.S. government approach. Uh, we believe we've made uh, good progress in uh, addressing the needs of the Ethiopian people, uh, specifically their health needs related to, to malaria. And these are examples, uh, tangible examples examples. As a, as a former military man, the, uh, uh, we, we have an extreme reluctance to engage in battle. What we really like is helping people. And while we're helping people in, gen in, in general, we think it's a lot less likely that somebody's going to be angry at us and shoot at us. So again, we like, we, if we're going to fight battles, we, we want that to be overseas. And malaria is a battle that we really love to, uh, uh, that's a kind of battle we love. And so, uh, so I'm lucky enough to be able to work in this field. Mm -hmm. um, and I think that the American people should feel good about to the extent that, that we're able to uh, really uh, 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 make progress on this disease. And in some countries, even uh, on the verge of eliminating it. Um, so the military, uh, the U.S. military here called CJATF HOA, partnered with uh, uh, the, the uh, Aromia uh, Regional Health Bureau to do, to, to do uh, two very large uh, bed net hanging campaigns and they hung uh, over uh, 40,000 nets directly uh, with, the, uh, with the assistance of local uh, officials and the coordination with that. So, but basically that goes a step beyond. I mean, first of all, we make sure that the bed net is opened and is given to the right person, goes to the right household, and that is, is uh, professionally uh, uh, hung up or in a, you know, best practices. And, uh, and then and and the, while we're doing that, our partners uh, in uh, behavioral change communications um, also gave the messages on how to properly care for them and, and you know, when to use the nets and, and how to take care of them. And therefore, we're trying to, we're pro the projected lifespan we're shooting for is three years. So we want, we want each net to last for three years because each net cost us about six dollars. And so we want, to, uh, we want the people to get the uh, every minute of possible protection for that six dollars that we're Uh, 50 million people in Ethiopia are at, at risk, so we need to provide enough nets uh, for them. So, you know, again, we've done 20 million nets every, uh, or we've done a round of 20 million nets, and now we're starting to replace. We're in the midst of uh, a total swap out of nets that were passed in, uh, uh, distributed in 2006 2007 timeframe. So now, uh, but, but, but there's a major investment to sustain the uh, uh, net protection, which is needed for every family um, in these malarious areas. This, uh, each, each net comes with a um, <coughs> one-page sheet of the four essential malaria actions um, that I mentioned to you before. Um, but this one specifically focusing on, on bed nets and how to hang the bed net, um, how to correctly use it, and also the ability to wash, wash. it.
and um, then to dry it. Uh, we, we believe that we're doing our duty the United States government and to uh, well worth the investment of people in the United States to be interested in the health uh, and welfare of people overseas and we can do this at a very low cost especially for diseases like malaria.